Well, I can tell you from past experience, this city is well worth a visit. We're in Seville at the Ramon Sanchez Pituan Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary position. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Spanish top flight, La Liga. It's Sevilla facing Villarreal. Yeah, thank you, Derek. Always my favourite time of the week, spending time with you at games. We should be in for a belter here with these two. Well, Suso, a player who always seems to have a spring in his step. I wonder, Lee, what you think we'll see from him in this game. Well, as a defender, when you're playing against a player like this, do your research, find out where he likes to go, where he likes to finish from. Trouble with this player, he likes to finish from anywhere. Just watch his long shooting. The Sevilla side as follows. Yassine Bounou is the goalkeeper. Lucas Ocampos plays with Suso in the wide positions. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. The Villarreal starting 11. Sergio Asenjo is the man between the posts. Dani Parejo starts alongside Manu Trigueros in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And the contest begins. Parejo, Estupiñan, and they've won possession again. Now he must favour the cross. Parejo, here's Moreno. Is it going to be? Pivotal moment defensively. And room now out on the wing. Cross could be useful. Rakitic has seen his pass gobbled up. Well, the attack looks promising. Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, he was so sharp, the goalkeeper there, wasn't he? What a wonderful save. Over it comes. And there it is, the opening goal, the ideal way to start. Well, here's another look at it. It's a good delivery from the corner, and then it's a good heady finish, to be fair. Keeper, no chance. Lovely goal. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. Well, I think the coach can feel the game slipping away here. He's showing his frustration on the sidelines. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Estupiñan. Parejo. Tervis Estupiñan. Torres on the ball. Read it superbly to take back possession. Now that's a well-timed pass. Now the task is to remain focused. It's opened up for him. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Yusef and Naziri. Well kept out. 
spot. They won't complain about having won the corner and maybe an opportunity to increase their advantage. Oh, he knows that could have been the game right there. You can see his frustration as well. And he's fired over the corner and fisted away. Able to close down the shot. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. Well, he got the touch on the ball. And so a corner it'll be. Played into the centre of the box. He succeeded in getting his fist to it. Could cross it in here. It did take a touch on the way through, hence a corner. And now the delivery, well cleared away. Another corner conceded, what can they do with this one? And firing it into the area, punching it clear. Ruben Peña. The coach will need more possession for Sevilla, but they won't mind with that. They're winning this game. They're sucking their opponents onto them. And with the pace they've got in midfield and up front, they're really causing problems. I'm well, being pressed here. And he read it superbly. Manu Trigueros. Moy Gomez. A danger here as he runs at them. Slipshod passing. And they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. Well, body in the way, vital intervention. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. Good use of the ball, but can they trouble the defence? Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Ruben Peña. It's with Raul Albiol. Gerard Moreno. And room now out on the wing. Really getting stuck in. Moreno, and with the goalkeeper. Now will the keeper have to pay the price for that mistake? Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. And the interception following the Rakitic pass. Parejo. He might be able to profit from the wide position. Gives it a go. Couldn't grab hold of it. Oh, tremendous block. Oh, covering up defensively. Well, they say goalkeepers are a breed apart. He's just kept his team in it. They'll be getting pats on the back for that. Pau Torres. Manu Trigueros has it. Oh, 
and in with a real chance. And it's there for him. Deary me, a golden chance missed. It might come back to haunt him. Well, you learn the script time and time again, and he's now just gone and fluffed his lines. Rakitic electing to play it forward, and he's in. Oh, that was a terrific stop in a one-versus-one one situation. Well, high fives all round for the goalkeeper. Absolutely fantastic. Here it is now, a substitution. And he's fired over the corner. Well punched away by the keeper. Prepare to take on the shot. Yet another tremendous save to add to the list. One fight. Over the touchline for a throw in. Substitution time it is here. Ivan Rakitic. And in the perfect position to read it. Moreno. Can they get in behind them? Well, when all was said and done, he's failed to hit the target. Ivan Rakitic. Oh, they've lost it. Well, Villarreal certainly enjoying the lion's share of possession, but they have to create more. They have to be more positive. The final third play has been slow, too predictable. And he takes it away. Just listen to the fans here, Derek. They've just kept their noses in front and these fans are doing their best to push them to the final whistle. Firing it in. And the keeper had a role to play. They're still within touching distance. Well, he's kept his team in the game. Simple as that. And it's a case of just five minutes left. Well, do they have it in them to level this? Fight. And take it away. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Chance to attack using wit. A decisive clearance it was. If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. And time for the change now. He's driven in the corner. And there it is, the final whistle, and it's a victory for the home side. They're going to be happy with this result, Lee. Yeah, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends. But they probably just about edged it overall and deserved the result. Well, as we run the rule over this man's work, positive after positive, Lee. He's always a man to watch for the opposition, but they couldn't keep tabs on him in that vital moment when he grabbed that goal.